Back now with one local business owner's plans to pitch in to help earthquake victims half a world away. And he has a very good reason to do so. The death toll from last week's quake in Turkey and Syria is now up to 35,000. Time is running out to find survivors in that rubble. Meantime, a lot of supplies are needed, and that's where a Williamsburg restaurant is coming in. Down your side's Amy Avery picks up the story from here. The owners of Old Town Pizza and Pasta here in Williamsburg tell me they were devastated to hear the heartbreaking news coming out of Turkey. So that's when they decided to band together with other restaurant owners to collect donations to send to help. Why not? I mean, we can do something. Old Town Pizza and Pasta owner Baki Anchu grew up in Turkey and says it's heartbreaking to see the devastation coming from his home country. His family is okay, but some of his former employees and friends have lost loved ones. Some of them, they lost their mom. Dad, brothers, sisters. It is heartbreaking. I cannot explain. There is no word for it. Nearby, Retro's Good Eats owner, Isan Kormis, is also from Turkey, about eight hours from where Baki grew up. He says he immediately called his mom to make sure she was okay. It's, it's terrifying. It's hard to get in because there are no service. But when you get them, you want to cry. Baki says the two came together to do what they can to help. They aren't collecting money or food, just items to send in a large shipping container to help recoup what was lost. Toothpaste, this is some lotion, shampoo. Everything from blankets to winter clothes and shoes to diapers. That side of Turkey, we have 10 big cities being collapsed and most of the kids need more belonging. Isan says it's really cold in the region where the earthquake hit and millions of people are now homeless. When we see TV, it's not the same. You know, if you look in the map from New Jersey to DC, basically, that's all they destroy. He says his customers and staff immediately started boxing up items too. And even my daughter, she is um, eight years old, she gave me a dollar. The restaurant owners say the images coming out of the country are so heartbreaking to see and they hope these items will help families rebuild. It just comes to you naturally. You want to help. Donations are being collected here at the restaurant and at several other restaurants here in the Williamsburg area. We'll have a list of some of those restaurants over on wavy.com. In Williamsburg, Amy Avery, 10 on your side.